All right, what's up guys? We are out on a toy hunt for the first time in quite a bit here on the channel. And you guys know I'm more of a uh, buy it on ringside if I can guy. But there's a couple things hitting stores uh, that you know I'm looking for right now. We have Legend Series 15, I believe it's 15. Uh, and the only one I want in the series is Kane, so I'm looking for Kane right now. And as, well, as well as Walmart, we're going to Target right now, but for Walmart, the uh, Ruthless Aggression Series 1 is hitting stores, which I already have pre-ordered on Walmart. Um, should be shipping next month, but if you guys watch the channel, you know that Ruthless Aggression, that's my time period. I'm a Ruthless Aggression kid. I won two of each series, one for mid on card, one to keep loose. So I don't know if we'll hit up any Walmarts, but we're here at Target looking for Kane Series 15. I think Ultimate Edition Series uh, 13 is hitting stores right now as well with Hulk Hogan and Mr. T. Don't have interest in Mr. T. Maybe in Hulk Hogan. I got to see it in person. Um, but there's a lot of Hogans coming out that have already come out. So I don't, it's not a must have, but you know, I'm definitely interested to see if they have it. But pulling up Target, we'll see what they got. We'll check the Star Wars stuff as well and uh, hopefully walk out with uh, something good. So let's get in to this video. Check the mic and make sure it sound right, boys. All right, we'll talk about starting off with a big old bust. That target sucked. Uh, Got to be one of the worst that we've ever shown here on the channel. Nothing. I mean, they did have some Batista Ultimate Edition figures, which, you know, it's funny how everyone was looking for for those for months, and then everyone got them, and then they finally just started flooding targets. So it is what it is. Hopefully, I'm hitting another target now. Hopefully, we find these new Legends figures. I, East Coast is always the last place to get everything, man. It's always just makes its way across the whole country. The East Coast is just the last. So I know to be patient with Le Legends figures because eventually they're going to show up and they're going to sit for, you know, a while because Legends figures always do. But hopefully, I can track them down. I want that cane in my collection. So another target, target number two. Let's see what they got. All right, here's what we're looking like in the toy section. Star Wars wise, we got a Tuscan Raider, which I don't need, but it is cool to see. Vintage collection, Lando. There's always a Lando. You can always expect to see some Lando. And WWE wise, a whole lot of Mysterios. Somebody show some respect and buy these Mysterios. I already have them, so I don't need them, but. And we got Batistas. Plenty. A big day. Somebody stole the world title out of that one, so you'd love to see it. Somebody stole the world title. It's just that one. Okay. Well, that's it for the toys. Striking out again. No cane. What can you do? All right. So no Legends figures at uh, Target number two, but we're pulling up to the first Walmart of the day. Probably the only Walmart of the day. I can only take so many Walmarts. But uh, the only reason I'm going here is to see if they have the Ruthless Aggression figures. I'm honestly, I, I, I doubt that they do. I don't even know if they hit this area yet, but it's worth checking. I know some people have found them, so hopefully we can. You know, we got Brock, we got Batista, we got Shawn Michaels. I need all three. Would be a major score if I can uh, walk out with all three of them today. So I don't know. We'll see. Realistically, they're probably going to have like a top picks Jeff Hardy and a basic freaking Nia Jax or something. I don't know, but we'll see what they got. Hopefully we walk out something good. All right, here's what we are looking at at Walmart. A lot of the same stuff. We got Unmasked Series 3, pretty much everybody, I think, but Anna J, a couple of uh, random figures here. Just a bunch of the same. We got Superstars Bray, a couple of them. Got another one down here with the Dustin Rhodes back there, AW Ring, all that stuff. Where's the Star Wars section? I think it's over here. Pass by because they have absolutely nothing. This is the Star Wars section. Absolutely abysmal. So, yeah, there's a reason that it's going to be the only Walmart for today because this sucked. So, let well, you guys know where we end up next. All right, as you guys saw, that Walmart sucked. Big surprise, not really. But I'm pulling up to another Target right now. I've had luck at this Target in the past. This is going back to a toy hunt in like March, but I found when I was first looking for um, Unmatched Series 3, coincidentally, I first found it here. I don't know if I've ever found anything else here, but I've had luck here before, so hopefully we'll find something. You guys know, looking for Legends 15. So going in now, hopefully I can walk out something.
All right, so not too bad at this Target. And you know, I said earlier that Ultimate Edition 13 was hitting stores. Mr. T, you know, definitely wasn't a must. Had my eye on the Hulk Hogan. They didn't have the Hulk Hogan, but they had the Mr. T and uh, it looked way cooler in person. So I just went ahead and bought it. And now I have to get the Hogan because I can't get this and not get the Hogan. You gotta get the WrestleMania one tag team. But this is the first time I saw this in person and I was like, you know what? I want to walk away with some today. So we got Mr. T here. And that's not the only thing we left Target with. No, 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 you guys know follow me on Instagram, active gym goer, active Zoa drinker, and Zoa 12 ounce cans are in Target now. Thank you, Dwayne Johnson. Pretty freaking pumped up. We got some wild orange, I got some fruit punch and super berry or whatever, tropical punch, whatever it's called back there. It's gonna make the gym session a lot better tonight. But Mr. T, Zoa's Target was successful. We're hitting one more and then we're gonna wrap it up for the day. So I'll let you guys know when we get there and maybe we'll still find Legend 15 King. You never know, you never know. So. We'll see what we can find. This one was successful. All right, guys, home from the little toy hunt today. I did end up going in that last Target, but they didn't have anything in there anyway, so I didn't even bother filming. But as you guys saw, we did pick up one thing today, which is nice. We have Ultimate Edition Series 13, Mr. T. This was like a little bit of an impulse buy, I'm not gonna lie, because I said literally in the beginning of this video, unintentionally, because I just knew these were hitting stores. Like, yeah, you know, Mr. T, probably not a must for me, or you know, didn't really have much interest in it, whatever I said. The Hulk Hogan I did have interest in it a little bit. Um, but then I saw the Mr. T. They didn't have the Hogan. I saw the Mr. T. They had two of them sitting there. And I'm sitting here and I'm looking at it. I'm like, this is a damn cool figure. So I was just like, you know what? I'm getting it. And now I have to get the Hulk Hogan so I can complete the set. But I'm not going to play it, man. It's an awesome figure. The accessories really make it for me. And uh, I'm really pumped up to uh, to get this out and you know, display it and stuff like that. I'm not going to unbox it here. I'll probably do a separate video or something like that. Uh, unboxing this figure i'll wait till i get the hogan and do them together or something like that but i'm super hyped up man i knew this figure was sick like i looked at it online before you know i don't know when this got revealed um you know obviously a while ago but i'm sure whatever got revealed i stated you know it's an awesome figure but it just wasn't for me but you know what things change <laughs> i ended up picking up the figure today and this technically is my only pickup today because as of today tuesday july the 26th i officially made my cody rhodes ultimate edition uh purchase for on a uh, mattel creation so i don't know when that's uh gonna be coming in i forget but um can't wait to get that up obviously it's a pre-order that is until friday so uh definitely if you're trying to pick up that cody rhodes ultimate edition figure on mattelcreations.com make sure you go ahead and pre-order that because by friday that's it you're done no more chances one week pre-order ends on friday definitely go ahead and do that and uh don't miss out because uh it's gonna, gonna be sucky if you miss out on that figure but yeah man new ultimate edition in the collection i'm looking forward to adding more you know we got a lot of good stuff coming up obviously the cody Rhodes, like i mentioned we got aj styles uh bret hart brock lesnar ultimate warrior some awesome ones coming up um what else is coming out soon ultimate edition well oh we got roman reigns and jeff hardy from ultimate edition 14 that is in stock of ringside i want to pick that up soon so a lot of good ultimate editions man uh i i will say i do still believe that this is the let me not knock over the figure already did i still do believe the ultimate edition the hottest line in wrestling figures today I have, you know two figures every set now you got the legends one is legends ones as well you have the fan takeover ones for a little while a lot of good stuff man just uh some of the best figures that you're gonna find out there so let me know down in the in the uh, comment section below a little added bonus here what guys do you want to see um get made in an ultimate edition figure you know there's a uh, ray mysterio i'd love to see an ultimate edition figure of him randy orton as well kurt angle is another one that i would love to see just get new wwe figures in general but get a legend series or excuse me a ultimate edition figure i think would be awesome then eddie guerrero those are probably my top four and if i had to round it out to a five just to for the fun of it here i don't know man maybe like a who would I want to round out a top five just for discussion purposes? Honestly, maybe like an 07, 08 Undertaker or maybe like an 07, 08 Edge, something from that world title, you know, SmackDown run, I think would uh, be cool. But definitely those first four I said, I'd love to see future Ultimate Edition figures made of those guys. But hey, let me know down below. Let's send Mattel some ideas. Obviously, we just had San Diego Comic-Con this past week. A lot of good stuff that obviously came out. I made videos covered all of it. So go check out some of the past content, guys. I will see you over there running down all those reveals. Awesome toy hunt today. First one in a while. I hope you guys enjoyed it. See you guys soon. Peace. Yeah, it's not a